Welcome everyone to WAW Aftermath. We are one week away from the 17th anniversary of WAW. X7. 17 years. Yep. 17 years. Oh, so many people here. We, we just got through Hellbound. Hellbound was great. It was hardcore all night. Big mess. Big mess. Lots Big of mess. mess. We're lot, just lot, lot of cleaning up. up from that. Bodies uh, everywhere, blood so everywhere, tables everywhere. We are one week everywhere. away from seeing Carnage versus Giles for the WAW title. Teacher versus student. Teacher versus student. It's going to be huge right. main event. And you got BTP versus the Middlesex Express for the first time ever, and also for the team titles. A dream match. Dream, dream match. Anyway, yep, absolutely. You. you got Sin versus Chad. And a no DQ match. Yeah. That And that... They have been at each other's throats. Chad Epic has shown parts of himself I didn't know he had. It is crazy personal. Let's also not forget we've got your brother, Flax, versus Sage. In a dog collar absolute victory match, you have to pin and submit your opponent while attached at the neck by a dog collar. It is going to be crazy. And let's not forget we also have got Shane White versus Kane versus Andrews. Past versus present versus future. Exactly. And that's exactly what the tagline of this match is. That's it's great. Perfect. It's going to be something to see, let me tell you. But we've also got tonight. But in order to get to next week, we've got to go through tonight. And tonight, we've got Rocco versus Allison versus Andrews in a triple threat. Coming up soon. Can't and, wait. And also, we've got... I don't know what we've got. <laughs> we've got we've got a whole show. We've got a whole show. We've got Kane uh, versus Chris Shady tonight. Kane is coming Return back. Return of the Twisted Preacher. And also we have Delilah versus Puma for the Pure Championship tonight. And that is going to be a huge match. There's a lot of history between those two. It's going to be a great main Puma event. Puma bought an extra big duffel bag just like a Carolee's belt song. I'm sure he did. It's beautiful. And well, in order to get to tonight's action, of course, yeah. you know what we always have to do: take it to Henry. Take it to Henry. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? <laughs> Welcome to WWE Aftermath. <laughs> Our opening contest. Shades of DX. Freeway dance. And it has a time to go. Aaron Kessler. Are you yeah. kidding me for right now? <laughs> Entry first. You would say that. Boxborough, Massachusetts, weighing in at 155 pounds and a height of five foot one. Allison Chase. Absolutely. The, the fans love how crazy Allison Chains is. She is a Looney Tune. That's one way to put it. She came to the arena dressed like this. This is, this is Allison like every day. This is the weekday. It is, this is her on a Tuesday. For her, it was Tuesday. Oh my gosh. Put those glasses on, Bart. Oh, Allison getting ready for her match tonight against Rocco and Thomas Andrews. This is definitely going to be one hell of a match for Allison because I haven't seen her in action with Thomas Andrews before, let alone in a three-way with Rocco. Yeah, absolutely. Rocco is the hardcore king, yeah. and, and Thomas Andrews is a powerhouse. So who knows what's going to happen. ready to go. What does that even mean? That means he is always ready to go, but he is always ready to go. You mean he wants to leave already? I mean, the match hasn't started yet. No, he's ready to fight. He's ready to oh, wrestle. Okay. He's ready to win all the I'm time. I'm thinking, like, you know, ready, like, call it night. And as you can see, Thomas Andrews just got up from a nap. Look at that bedhead. He, that's, that's Thomas Andrews in a nutshell. Always ready to go. He wakes up, boom, ready to go, right from the bed. You are absolutely right, Castle. Pinch me right out of the bed, ready to go. Look at that cow lick. And I love it. From Salem, Massachusetts, up to the ring by Stellion Avenelli. Here's the King of Violence, the Halloween Hellraiser, Rocco. Now, Rocco is coming off a huge loss against Pyro in an insane last man standing match at Hellbound. How is that being wheeled out here right now by Selena? I know. Beyond me. You never know. We haven't seen him yet. And yeah, there that, he is. Yep. Still walking. How does he not have to use a walker? Unbreakable. He's, he's unbreakable. The king of, he's the king of violence. He's, there's a reason why he's a Hall of Famer, Darren Castle. Yeah, there's a reason why he's been around this long doing what he does, I guess. Dragonfire, no pile of upright stars. 
Bouncing off that, those ropes. A little homage to his other, uh, the other king. All right, this match is underway, and now this is obviously no disqualification because this is a three-way Rocco. Rocco already outside the ring. He's not even gonna get involved. She got eliminated versus me. They're not happy. What are they picking? They're not even gonna leave this match. He's working. Oh, hold on. Incoming. Uh oh. No. Really? No. Oh, look at that. And Selena <laughs> holding on to Thomas Andrews. Hips onto his ankle. Of course. Yeah. Not smart. Not smart at all. Smart. I mean, it might be clever for Rocco because now he's taking complete advantage of Allison Chains. Yeah, I mean, that helps Rocco out. And. I mean, then. Rocco. Trying to use the numbers. But not smart for Selena. She I mean, she, she's going to get hurt. Join me, Selena. Join the dark side. Oh no! Oh my god! And it noise like duplex. Good god. That was incredible. Looks like that's a no from Thomas Andrews. Hopefully that didn't take too much out of Thomas Andrews, but it looked like it did, and he's still up and he's ready to go. And he's delivering that pain. He is always ready to go. Now working with Allison, they got, they got, trying to take down Rocco. Oh, of course, Selena getting herself involved again. Game plan. Selena, what, what does she think she's doing? A huge factor. Come on, ref, get in there. Now Rocco is an eye rake. We're having a good old cat, oh, fashioned cat fight outside the ring <laughs> while Rocco is taking it to Thomas Andrews. Yeah, I mean, Stalina just going to town on Allison. Rocco's going to town on Thomas Andrews. What do you say? What do you say? Oh. choke in the corner, I'll be a oh. And that bulldog that Allison is famous for. Did she make the oh. Look out! Oh. Rock! Thomas Andrews saving. Saving his Rocco. match, <laughs> saving, saving himself. He wants that victory. Yeah, he wants it. He wants it bad. Rocco. I mean, Thomas Andrews, he's been on fire for the past few months. Yeah, he's win after win. Look at that. Huge streak of momentum for Thomas Andrews. I mean, he almost had that held on match one against Grim and Draven. Yeah, he's beaten Draven and Grimm in one match, oh. in the same match. They, he took them both on. Yeah, unfortunately it wasn't at the Hellbound match, so that would have skyrocketed him to the top. Absolutely. If he had won it like he had won that first time, who knows where he'd be right now. But you know what, it's not over for Thomas Andrews. No, I mean, Allison almost was trying to go for that Tornado DDT, but Thomas Andrews, just, just being the statue of a man he is, just was not taking any of that. Stelina. Look out! Oh, pumpkin crusher to Thomas Andrews. I don't know what Stelina's talking about, but we've got a match here. Stelina talking about her lawyer. We have no idea what that's all about, but Rocco. Oh, backbreaker. Back broken. That, this could be it. that does not feel good at all. Yet. No, it's right on your spine. Especially when he's working on that back the whole match. And now, oh. kick to the face. Good God. I'm going to about that. See that heel collide with the forehead of Alice in Chains. Right now, it's not looking good for Allison, but Thomas Andrews breaking up that pin. Again. She did a seat. They want to throw it. in the back of your head. Thomas Andrews just throwing Rocco around like nothing. Wait, was he a farm boy? I swear, he had to be a farm boy. Oh, that pump handle. Now what? No, He's not done with for, Rocco. Calling for Allison to go up top. Oh, send him up. Yeah. There's 
is the Tornado DDT. Yes, Tornado DDT. Absolutely, Castle. Tornado DDT. Right, Buck? Tornado DDT. That's what I said, right? Yeah, I don't think you said that. This guy know what Trippie did. No, 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 no. no. You're, you're still saying it wrong. I, I, I'm still saying it. I don't know. It's you're not, you're not, you're not pronouncing it right. Pronounce tornado. tornado. Allison, now face to face with Thomas Andrews. Tornado, tornado, she needs to capitalize right, right here, but Thomas Andrews now taking advantage of the situation. Yes. Trying to take control of this like a three way mat. The carcass. Huge shoulder thrust to Allison Chains. Selena fanning down her husband. I don't know how much that's going to work. Oh, no. What's going on here? Uh oh, Allison. Allison reversing Thomas Andrews. Oh boy. But oh, a chair shot. Rocco, and that's totally legal in this match. Oh, I don't understand how that worked. He hit her from the outside. She was on the inside. I mean, how does that work? No disqualification. No disqualification. A low blow from Stalina. Come on. Really? One, two, three. I, I can't even believe what I just saw. This wow. is so. What? How is that fair? I mean. It's not illegal in a three-way match, but clearly a very dishonorable win once again for Rocco. I mean, he does not even care. Thomas Andrews trying to get out of here with balls intact. He's not feeling too good. Rocco, you can just tell he just doesn't even he just doesn't even care about honor or sportsmanship. something. Referee Pepe Sylvia's first Pyro. day in the job and he's already Pyro strolling on mosey on in here over here. Directors are now. Done? Are, you, are you done with this? No. Well, no. no. If Rocco wants to keep attacking me physically or verbally, then I'll be going to him. Mentally and emotionally. <laughs> right, you know what? You know what? Why don't we do one more match? Why don't we? Why don't we do this for the anniversary show? Oh boy. <laughs> Boy, the show keeps getting better and better. Oh, but there's more. Better. Why don't we do a first time ever team steel chairs? Wow. Okay. okay. And because I said that, I'm going to throw one more little twist. Uh -oh. Rocco, I'll let you pick Cairo's partner, but on that same note, Cairo. Now that's interesting. That's stirring the potter. You don't have to wait, I know who I'm gonna pick. You Daddy, see? Hey, Gabby, with the chair. You, you, you like, you don't work, you like going tweet, tweet. They, they like to be fire around you, don't you? I, I like where you're going. Keep going. You, you guys see where I'm going with this? Yes. Where's Gabby Fire is? Wait for it. Allison! Oh. Uh, of course. As he tenderizes okay, Allison. Okay, I can see where you're going with this. I have an idea of my own. Next week, your tag team partner will be your wife, <laughs> Selena. Yeah, but uh, to the other crowd, that's when they need that rock that you live in for something that wasn't wrestling, and check the internet, you would know I have a cyst on my ankle. 
Keith. It's not as small. Fallout 4 came out. Of course, like she wasn't beating on anybody ringside. She seemed to be close Friday night. You ready? You ready? Yeah. I believe I just heard Captain Vincent Zarella. He's a captain. He's 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 said, he said captain. He said captain. He said captain. Well, second greatest captain of all time. The Amazing Three Night next week. Yeah. Yeah. The Amazing Three Night. Rocco was elated. Wait. So wait, I was he gonna smile on his face. Yeah. yeah. Captain Zarello. And well, what's the smirk about? I don't. I don't. What is he doing? Captain, you guys will like this. Captain. Yeah. Uh, well, we all know Captain. I mean, uh, he was on. He was on the Full Metal, uh, Full Metal, Metal Jacket, Jacket Hall of Famer. Hall of Famer. I. Wow. I, we haven't a seen. Long time. We haven't seen him in a long, long, long time. <laughs> Allison, she's all right. You all right? You all right? I'm sorry. Allison, to hear that. looking a little uh, out of it. A little out of it. Yeah, I mean, I probably would be That's if I got hit with a chair. Her thing, though, isn't it? Well, I mean, she also got hit with a chair about. In I don't the know. Back. Come on, like, like you're saying, 15 back in time. The fact that she's walking and not in a wheelchair right now. Yeah, right. I mean, seriously, anybody that go, gets in that ring gets hit with anything. I mean, you know, I mean, we're at, they're at risk. Yeah, they're all at risk. So don't try it at home, kids. And anyway, let's get to some more wrestling. And in order to do that, we need to click the next link. Aftermath.